Hey guys, Krista Jones here from Davy and Krista. And in this video, I am going to show you how to import a canvas from another site or another or your original template to your design. Um, so if I'm on any page, I can come up to these three little dots right here and click add new canvas. And from here, I can navigate to either the sites, the canvases within my site, or I can go to my other sites. So I have a ton of templates, but if I wanted to import something from my Bondi site, um, and if you had an older site that you wanted to import something from, you could just open it up and find the canvas. So if it's a site canvas, you can find it here. If it's actually an individual canvas on a page, you can open up the page and look for things here. Um, so if I wanted to import this welcome canvas, I could click on it. And I can choose to either import the original design, which is going to bring in all of the fonts and colors uh, and actually add these fonts to my current site. Or I can try applying my fonts and colors. Um, if you want to use the fonts and colors in your original design, I would just choose use original design. But if you know you're going to change them and you don't want new fonts added to your library because it can just mess things up else, like all over the place, um, I would choose apply my fonts and colors. Just once you add it, you may need to come in. It always goes to the bottom, so you need to move it up. Um, you'll just need to come in and set your own spots. So like if you wanted to make this the title and then change that to make it look better, and you would still need to adjust more. Um, but that's how I would do it so that the fonts don't override your existing fonts and kind of make things look wonky. Um, if you want to add something from like the original template, like if you messed up a canvas and you need to re-import it, you can come up to those three dots again and go to add new canvas and go to my library and then um, just open up. If you have multiple templates that you've added, you'll see them all here. I'm just going to click on the one that's my name um, that I've imported this site. And then I can just go like I did before and just find a canvas and either use the original design or apply my fonts and colors. Um, which one you choose probably depends on how much you've customized your template. Um, so if I wanted to start with this, I could, and then I would just need to add it to my site and replace it with the section that I had needed to replace. All right, I wanna add a note to say that if you are going to add a new site canvas, like if you, for some reason, really messed up your navigation on Whitehaven and you wanted to add back the original navigation, I would delete this navigation from your site so it's completely gone and then come back up to site canvases here and click add new site canvas. And then you would go back to your library and let's say we're adding the navigation from this, let's pretend this is the original Whitehaven template. If I choose to add this here and I add it back, um, I'll have that new navigation in my site canvas, but then I need to go back and I'm gonna need to re-add it to all of my pages um, because the old one will have been gone and then you just need to replace it with the new one. Um, so I hope that helps. And if you have any other questions about adding site canvases, you can always message show it or you can email us at support at